The essential features of learning at Wood Hill that we feel define the way we do things at our school start with the learning environment. For me, the learning environment embodies the ambition and the expectation for children. The learning environment is the second teacher. It's the invisible teacher. It helps children understand the expectation. It provides clarity. It, it, it provides the ambition. And we believe that beautiful spaces create beautiful children. We believe that the learning environment is an essential dynamic to quality learning experiences. Now, linked to the learning environment, we believe that the quality of modelling of expectation from teachers is critical. Our children may not see quality modelled every day, everywhere they go. We believe that adults have a responsibility through the way they organise lessons to model excellence and enable children to see what excellence looks like. And we believe this needs to be captured in the learning environment and captured as, as an integral feature to teaching sequences. The third aspect that we believe is essential to great learning within our school is the quality of dialogue and feedback for learning. And that takes, that takes the shape of the quality of interaction between adults and children in lessons. So the way adults use mini plenaries, the way that the staff are able to assess and adapt teaching and learning sequences as they're teaching, but also the quality of exchange around learning that we evidence through pupil books. And we believe that's critical. The fourth dynamic that we believe is, is essential and defines the way we do things is the quality of curriculum. The quality of curriculum at Wood Hill, is, it, it's the vessel or the vehicle for which we enable great learning to happen. And at Wood Hill Primary School, what you'll see is that the curriculum is, is, is fluid, it's creative, it, 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 it flexes where it needs to to meet children's needs, but it's also ambitious so that the expectations for excellence are absolutely rooted in a quality curriculum experience. And lastly, one thing that we feel that, that, that kind of brings all this together is that we have a philosophy at our school that, that children are entitled to, to see excellence but also to achieve excellence. So for that reason, publishing outcomes, publishing children's learning and children understanding that, that the journey for learning sequences over a half term or sometimes over a term culminates in children having multiple opportunities to publish quality learning because the published quality learning is the, is the place and time at which they can look back and reflect on their learning and say, wow, I did that and I can do amazing things when I come to this school. And it's the culmination of, of all of the teaching and learning sequences that take place over time. It's the culmination of great feedback, great expectations through the learning environment and great modelling. And it enables children and our community to celebrate greatness. Our kids can achieve excellence. And that's a really key message for our staff and for our community.